This video will explain how to set up and connect a streaming media player to display content on your television. With the player connected to the internet, you can access Viera Connect on your TV to enjoy services like Netflix, YouTube, Skype, Facebook, and others. Use a high-speed HDMI cable to connect your television. Make sure that both the television and player are unplugged from the AC power. Then plug an HDMI cable into the HDMI AV Out terminal on the back of the player. Plug the other end of the HDMI cable into an available HDMI in terminal on your TV. Then plug both units into the AC power. There are two options to connect the player to your home network, wired or wireless. This video will show you how to connect with the player's built-in Wi-Fi. To make a wireless connection, you will need to know your Wi-Fi network name. If your wireless connection is secured, please be sure that you know the wireless password as set at the router. Turn the television on and set the TV to the HDMI input connection you chose for the media player. Turn on the media player and with the player's remote, Press OK to select Setup. Use the right arrow button to select Player Settings, and then select Network. Press OK. Navigate to Easy Network Settings and press OK. Then select Wireless and press OK again. You will be given a choice to connect by searching for a network or by connecting using the WPS Push Button method. If your router has a WPS feature, you can choose that method to connect while simultaneously pushing the WPS button on your router. If you would like to search for a network, select Search for Wireless Network. The available wireless networks will be displayed. Select your network name and press OK. If your wireless network is secured with encryption, press OK to select Encryption Key. Enter in your encryption key often referred to as a password. Please be aware that passwords are case sensitive. Once your password is entered, select Finish and then select Set. The player will then connect to the network. Then, request a network connection check. Press OK. Once the player's network settings are configured, press the Home button and select the network service icon. The Viera Connect screen will now appear. Use the arrow buttons to find the service that you want, and then press OK to make a selection. From time to time, Panasonic will add new apps, so make sure to check back. Also, the player's internal software, called firmware, may need to be updated to support new apps. If the player is connected to the Internet, then an update screen will pop up automatically when a new version of firmware is available. Always update the firmware to ensure that any additional features or product improvements are loaded into your player. To update the player's firmware manually, go to the Setup menu and then select Player Settings. Select System and press OK. Now select Firmware Update and press OK. Then select Update Now. Do not disconnect the player or shut it off while it is performing the update which will take several minutes. The player will restart when the update is complete. If the player is not directly connected to the Internet, you can use your computer to download the latest firmware from the Panasonic support site. Now we'll explain how to use your player to access your videos, photos, and music stored on a DLNA certified media server, such as a Windows 7 PC, or other DLNA certified devices. You will be able to enjoy your media on the TV through your home network. With your Windows 7 PC connected to your home network, go to the control panel. In the Network and Internet section, click on Choose Home Group and Sharing Options. Then, under the Share Media with Devices, enable Stream My Pictures, Music, and Videos to all devices on my home network. Your media file must be stored in the computer's library to be shared. Using the player's remote control, go to the home screen and select Home Network. 
and then select DLNA from the menu choices and press OK on your Windows 7 server. The content of the server will now be displayed on screen. Using the up down arrow button select the media you wish to access. You may be able to use convenient control panel functions depending on the content by pressing the option button on your remote. The control panel is displayed once the playback starts. If it doesn't appear, try pressing OK. Enjoy your Panasonic streaming media player.